Hey, I know you. No, you don't. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you put up in a damn place. Quick fan here. You don't know me, you drunk bastard. All right, guys. Heading into the bar. Looking for someone. Find that guy that we uh figured out about on the uh, on the last episode. Let's talk to the bartender. You know Frank Morgan? Yeah, Frank sure. Morgan. I couldn't think of his Frank's name. Your <laughs> He's a loner in the back. Appreciate that, my good man. Look at my black brother right here. What you drinking on? At the, at the boy singing his ass on nobody knows the trouble I'm in. Is that you? Let me holler at you, Cole brother. Felt, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know him. Are you aware that he's missing? No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. All right. Let's uh, go on and uh, interrogate this sucker. We found Black's car abandoned in a freight depot, covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian. He, he's a good no, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk off, Phelps. Hell no. Fuck no, man. Look at her. Look, look like old drunk ass fish or something. <laughs> You going to jail, motherfucker. You better tell us what we want to know. All right. So he's obviously lying. You're lying, Morgan. You were there. And you're talking out your ass, detective. How about you prove I was out at that rail yard? Oh, I will. I will. All right. So what evidence w w will I do it with? <laughs> I don't know how much power to prove it. All right. So the bloody pipe, I don't think that's it. Oh... Uh, Match, I mean, the matchbox didn't have any fingerprints on it. Did the, uh, nah, that's, that's the receipt. It's the flyer. Uh oh. I think I'm screwed, guys. I don't know if I got anything to, to link his ass. Let's see the event. I mean, the vehicle. Could, could it? All right, the blood. Hold on, hold on, guys. Give me a second. Wait, wait, wait a second now. We're gonna figure this out. Uh, Live. Oh, oh, the body. live hog. Yeah, it had his name up on it. There, there's his name right there. Cool. All right. Yes. You were there, Morgan. We found a receipt in the trunk of the car. It has your name. Yeah. We can call the What you gonna say now? All right, already. Yeah. That fool okay. Adrian's falling for some dame in Seattle. Come clean. He wanted me to make it look like you've been attacked. <laughs> your ass just threw a whole paint can. In the front seat, look like man, just threw blood everywhere. Crazy ass. All right, so where is Adrian? Then? Where exactly is Black holed up? No idea. I think he took off for Seattle. You gonna play with my intelligence like that, brother? This guy, I, I don't, I don't know. Like he's, he's obviously not telling the truth. You know, he, he probably. He, I'm, I don't know if Adrian did go to Seattle or not. I mean, we've seen the information at the uh, at the house. You know, what I mean, he he did have that little ticket, and his luggage was was gone. But this little this this little weasel right here, I can't trust him, man. I don't know. But he he's making eye contact now, like he he think he, he he's scot free. So we gonna say we gonna meet him right in the middle. When they like this right here, it's it's, it's hard to, to to judge him. So I'm gonna say uh I'm gonna say doubt. I'm tired of your shtick, Morgan. Spill it! Or we take you out in the alley and we knock it out of you. We're we gonna beat your ass place. till you tell us what we wanna know. That's what he wanted to say. Town. An address. Okay, that's all you had to it's say. Look at this. Now we free. Temple in Figueroa. Apartment number go. two. Boom, shaka locker, baby. Thanks for your help, Morgan. We appreciate it. Hey, I'm just glad. I'm glad I, I thought help. about that second one because I was gonna say he was lying. Cops. I probably got that wrong. Cuff him, let him go. It's up to you, Phelps. No way I'm writing this idiot up. What? Press what A to that? arrest the suspect or let him out. Hell no. Nah. Arrest this motherfucker. He was impeding our police process. So his ass going to jail to hang out with Butch. Butch gonna play you with your Morgan booty Harris. hole for a couple of hours. Let's get over to then we'll, you know, let you out. Alright, so we going to his apartment to talk to old Adrian. Hell no. Nah. What you doing, brother? Get your... No. What are you doing? You get your ass over there. You know I don't drive nowhere. My driving days is over. My partner, you a good partner. You smart, buddy. You lawyer. 
I appreciate you. Seven <laughs> K, go ahead. Auto drive nowhere. Message from technical services. One found in the abandoned Lincoln at the PE freight depot is not human. Repeat, not human. Compositional analysis reveals swine as the most likely match. Roger, KGPL. Kind of reel this guy in, folks. Let's check the All place right. out. I want to check them out, guys. Let's see, what, hold on. It vibrated when we got right here. All right, apartment number two, Frank Morgan. Apartment two. Cool. Let's go and say hello, guys. The forceful way. Let's kick that motherfucker. Let's kick the dough in. Like, bitch, the jig is up. We know what you're trying to do here. All right, which way? All right, so we're going this way. All right, where is one? All right, here go two. Boom shaka laka. Help you gentlemen? What's up, Adrian? Huh? Detectives, Mr. Black. How you doing? Look, I'm really sorry about this. I never tried to hurt anyone. I just needed to get away from LA. You hurt your wife? I won't put up a You struggle. hurt your wife? Just let me get my things. No, motherfucker. We we finna snatch you your ass clean out that bill cop this weather. Come here, bitch! Remember, How did this fat ass run away that quick? Hold on. Damn it, you quick for a big guy. All these big guys in this game are are exceptionally fast. Where'd he go? Where the hell did he go? Damn it, I'ma lose him. I'ma lose him, I'm gonna speed up. Ah shit. Boy, I thought I was gonna break my damn uh, Damn it, how the hell did he get his ass over there that quick? Come here, come here. There you go. Let's get down there. Slide, 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 slide. You a firefighter. Ah ha ha! We got you anyway. Can I tackle it? Let me tackle that bit. Why not just come clean with her, Black? Why the melodrama? I thought it would be easier. No, it just got a whole lot harder. Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. Exactly. You're going to lose your wife, lose your job, and probably end up in the big house. I hope she was worth it, Adrian. On some booty. That turned out to be quite some case, huh? Adrian, what an idiot. You got an arrest and a clearance in your first case, and in fine style, too. Well done, detective. Efficient investigation technique, good public presence. You keep that up, and you learn from Bukowski here, you could go a long way in this department. Bukowski ain't shit. All right, guys. We got that all taken care of. We did very well, man. Look, at we got all the clues, answered all the questions correct. Okay, like we're, we're in the classroom or something. They're about to give us for the paperwork. DA. First up, Phelps, Bukowski. We got a report of a brand new Packard abandoned in an empty lot off 2nd Street between Olive and Grand. PR is one Oswald Jacobs says the vehicle was dumped in his backyard. There's a patrolman on site. Get down there and see what you can turn up. Any questions? Good. Get going. I mean, he let her answer. I mean, we, I, I, I had a question. wages. But I guess, you know what I mean? Rimsky, you don't, you don't hear. I understand. has information on a stolen car wreck. An All abandoned right. vehicle. Catch all the good ones. Let's just, uh, let's go and get after Sounds it, like man. We don't need to talk nobody that. up in here. Nobody dumps a shiny new Packard unless they borrowed it without asking. You don't say. You're on fire today, Einstein. Very funny. All right, where's my partner at? I need him to drive. Let's go save the world. Did I, did I lock him in there? You can't open the door? Let me open the door for him. There we go. Come on. Officer Houlihan. Car's down the alleyway, detectives. Like we're in the hood right now. Oh yeah, we're in the hood. That bit missing a tile on bricks. We got a call about an abandoned vehicle. Yes, sir. The car has flags. Might be some kind of diplomatic vehicle. Has anyone touched this vehicle since you arrived? No. And that Jacob's bird over there was on station before I got here. We'll talk with him in a moment. Give us some time to look the place over. Sure. Take your time. He's a sore-headed old son of a bitch, anyway. <laughs> what well, he must be nosy or something. All right, let's uh. Let's come over here, man. Check the vehicle out, guys. See what we got here. What is that? Registration. 
It's owned by the Argentinian Embassy. All right. You guys can pause the video if you guys need to read it in that. I'm going straight to the trunk. Empty. God damn, they... They done raided this damn trunk. Ain't nothing in this in this shit. All right. Let's come over here to this little tire. Swap well, the where the tire's way. supposed to be at. All right, missing wheel. wheels. This is for amateurs. The car ring would have stripped it in a warehouse. And why would they only take one wheel? Like, what's 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 the point of that? You gonna get all? I mean, if you gonna get the wheels, you get all four of them. Somebody was in desperate need of a, of a spare then, <laughs> and I'm missing license plate. What the hell? All right, that that makes no sense. These clues suck. These was the most garbage clues of the game thus far. All right, let's uh let's go around, man. See if we can get some better clues our damn self. So. Right, see, can we talk to to a young lady right here? Did she see anything? Uh oh. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm being all managed. Just I'm all on this leg. I don't even know this name. I'm all on a booty like that. I don't give no damn. Let me see. Okay, we got some people around here. Hold on. What is this? We got a bottle. What they were drinking on? Like a Heineken bottle. Ain't nothing. Ah, damn. All right, we put it back down. What about these people? They see anything? Nobody see, Nobody saw nothing. I see about six set of eyes right there. I mean, three sets of eyes. Ain't nobody seen nothing. Hang their clothes out of shit. Some of y'all watch me still hang y'all their clothes out. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with it. You do what you do. All right, what is this right here? We need to use, use police phone? No? Okay. You got just max. He, my boy here just maxing and relaxing. He ain't got a care in the world. Let the real professionals handle the job. What about up in there? Nothing. None with the trash cans. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I see something. We got a bat right here. Let's check out the bat, guys. Is there anything? Irrelevant. I was going to find like some blood or something up on it. We got another clue right here. Let's check this uh this is what they took the tires off with, I know. Head head to be. Combination wrench. Must have used it to remove the wheel lugs. Yeah. Well, I know they were struggling like a motherfucker trying to get some wheels off that thing. Using a wrench, man. I, I know they tore their damn hands all up. Alright, anything else? Let's make sure, guys. Let's look around, look around. Got a little phone going on. Cole Phelps, badge 1247. How could I help, detective? Could you run the name Dewey Brother? Possibly a dealership or car mechanics workshop. One moment. Dewey Brothers Packard Dealership, 629 Figueroa Street. Got it. Thank you. All right. All right, did you find anything that I missed, perhaps? Of course you didn't, because I don't miss shit. I find it all, baby. I don't leave no damn tone. I have said tone. Stone unturned. What about this lady over here? Did, did you see anything? Oh, yeah, you you nice, too. I like I like your whole ensemble, honey. Nice shoes. You got, you know me. You got your shit together, look like. But you missing one thing. She like, what is that? Me. Can I get your number, please? I ain't married or nothing like that. Well, fuck you too, then. Shit, you don't want to get... Hey, I'm gone. I'm gone. I don't play, I don't play no game with these slugs, man. I asked them once. I will not I will not ask you twice. She had to think about it. I don't play that shit. Don't, you, don't, you don't need to think about it. Oswald Jacobs? That's right. What exactly happened here, Mr. Jacobs? Last night, I was looking out of my window. I like to keep an eye on what's going on. I can understand yeah, you look that. Nosy. You see this empty lot? Damn kids play stickball here. Always breaking my windows. Always asking for their ball back. Can we get back to the car, Mr. Jacobs? Don't be impatient, Sonny. Anyway, Sonny. 
Last night, I see a brand spanking new Packard up on brick. Look at his eyes. He crossed like a mother. All right. Let's get the witness report. Did you see who stole the Packard? Hell yes, I did. I saw three goddamn Mexicans going to work on it. Yeah, why they got to be goddamn Mexicans, man? You just look like you're telling the truth, though. Um, he, he, he's looking us right in the eyes. All right, we're going to say you're telling the truth. Can you tell us what they were doing? Using the headlights of an old Ford so they could strip the thing. I yelled out to them, I'll call the cops. So they loaded up their car and drove off, tooting and hollering and yelling obscenities at me in Mexican. You speak Spanish? <laughs> no, I do not. Well, how you know if they were saying anything towards you? They probably was saying, man, stop by the... Uh, the corner store, we need some gas or something. Who, who knows, you know? All right, let's uh, ask about his family. After the uh, Mexicans left, you didn't go anywhere near the car? After I scared him off? No, I didn't go anywhere near that car. Really? Look, look, look at... He, 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 he's stopping himself from laughing right now. Look, look at his face. You just gonna do you you acting like you the first person that we interrogated. Like we ask questions about. Come on, bro. Um I ain't gonna say one hundred percent lying, but he, he is is definitely doubtful, man. Hell no. Out Come on, car. bro. Once they were gone, you had to take a look for yourself. I was curious. You went all through that Hell damn glove apartment box. So what if I took a look around that car? You can't. You don't suppose it's not yours. Nothing? Silly, goofy motherfucker, man. Just goofy guy. Tell me about the car they were driving. It was an old Ford. I didn't catch the license number. All right. It looked like he probably telling the truth right there. Yeah, I don't seem like it's something that he, he'll lie about. You look like the kind of guy who notices details. You're right there. The car was old. Look at him. He getting happy. He don't know. I'm calling him a snitch on the slick. Candy, apple, red, paint job. Stands out a mile. <laughs> this guy's a silly motherfucker. Look at his face. Uh, all right, vehicle script for parts. What exactly did you see them take? They was working on the tires. That's all that was took. Look, look at my guys, man. They, they like this guy is such a bad liar. It is ridiculous, man. That shit crazy. Come on, man. Like, look at his face. You can, you can automatically tell when he's lying and when he's telling the truth. Um, do we do we want to do liar or doubt? Mm. Every time I do lie, like I mean, you you have to know without a shadow of a doubt on this game, guys, to to hit lie because you'll ruin the whole investigation at that point. So it, it's kind of better to just you know if if you have a question in your head whether they're telling the truth or not, just hit doubt. Right. And that's that's usually how I do. So what did you take, Jacobs? Do you want Let's my partner to right. pat you down? I found a notebook in the glove compartment. Oh, okay, I was yeah. going to show you. It's on the chair sure on you my was. porch. Thank you for your help, Mr. Jacobs. You can speak to Officer Tabot about signing a formal statement. When you get the car out of the way, maybe you could come back and do something about those kids. Well, how about we bring you an umpire's mask? Ah! <laughs> That what you get, trick? All right, now you said something about a notebook or something over here, right? I need that, brother. You confiscating evidence. All right, let's uh do a little little investigating, a little extra investigate. Okay, so we have the owner of the vehicle, a degenerate. I'll run John Madsen by R&I. All right, cool. Do we need to look at anything else? Contact oh, that's the Dewey guy. William Dewey. This looks like business rather than pleasure. Cool, cool. All right, I think that's it right there. All right, guys, I think I'm going to go and wrap the video up right there. Hopefully, man, you guys enjoyed. If you did, definitely hit that like button for your boy. Anybody new to the channel, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Continue checking the playlist, guys. Episodes will be in that bad boy before I make them go public. Appreciate all the support you guys are showing to this series. Continue with the likes. The videos keep on getting knocked out for you. Other than that, 
I will see you on the next video.